the Walpole Island First Nations Ferry in my riding of Lambton Kent Middlesex is a critical connection between the island and Algonac, Michigan. The ferry plays a significant role in the daily lives of this community and is essential to the local economy. The ferry has been shut down since the beginning of the pandemic and the land borders have reopened, but the ferry still can't run. So it's shameful to see this Liberal government allow a critical part of this First Nations community to be falling through the cracks. So Mr. Speaker, my question is simple. When will the minister treat the Walpole Island Ferry like the land border crossings? Hey, great question. The Honourable Minister. thank my colleagues for their applause. It's always an honor to stand in this House of Commons to answer questions. Mr. Speaker, I want to let my colleagues that the health and safety of Canadians is paramount for our government. We have been working with communities on making sure that we apply health and safety standards at the borders. We are requiring travelers to be fully vaccinated. We are working with stakeholders to make sure that... Let me know when you're ready. I'll, I'll continue the, the session. Bill, you would have done a better job. Give it to Order. 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 Thank you. The Honourable Minister of Transport, please. Mr. Speaker, I wish uh, Canadians could hear some of the heckles that are going on here in this House of Commons. They would not be happy that members of Parliament here, they're supposed to be doing their job, are spending their time heckling. But however, Mr. Speaker, I want to tell you and I want to tell my colleagues here that we are doing everything we can to ensure that we protect the health and safety of Canadians and we are applying borders measures to protect everyone. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.